Having fun talking to your imaginary friend, did you? Ollie boy? Better better than talking to your real friends, was it? Huh? Imaginary friend? You mean P? P? Who's that? What do you mean? She's right here. Oh, come on. Can we stop doing this over and over again? Um, I don't see anyone. Maybe, maybe you, maybe only you can see her, Oliver. Really? But how come? Well, maybe it's just like how Myrtle can't see me, but I can't see her. But I can see her. You might be right. You might be right, you know. I never, I've never seen this P either. Anyway, what do you, what did P say to you, Oliver? Oh yeah, she told me to use magic to make some cheese. What's that? Make, make it with magic, say? You make it with magic, you say? Well, she may be a bit shy to let, let us see her, but she ain't afraid to stick her neck out, stick her neck out of ice wise. You mean, it won't work? Nah, man, it'll work. The whole point of magic is to make the impossible possible, ain't it? But, I guess it is, it, it's, it's difficult without the right ingredients, huh? But we do have them. We do? Of course we do. Back in Alma Moon. The fountains of milk. So we use magic to turn milk into fount fountains into cheese? Now that now that we can do now that we can do tidy. Right oh Ollie boy, let's go back to our, our world, shall we? Yes, let's go straight to the fountains of milk and try it out. To the main square back to Alma Moon. Well, that was a fucking pointless adventure. Nah, nah, we learned something. We learned that she likes cheese and how to make the cheese. Yeah, but really, is Layla's store the only place that sells cheese? Well, yeah, it's a small town, I, I guess. Why don't you just... What? Fine, just... Magic! Use it! Idiot. Ah, probably won't cost a damn spell point. We'll see. Oh, look. Sparkly. I'm concerned for your sanity. A kid ninja running. I'm pretending I'm Naruto. <laughs> I didn't know those were fountains of milk. I never really looked at it. Hmm. Imagine how gross that'd be. The milk must be warm sitting in the sun. Sour as hell. So these are the fountains of milk. Gee. Is that real milk? For real? <laughs> of course. The, f the freshest, creamiest milk there is. And there's... So much of it, you just can't keep trying until you get in, get it right. Keep trying. You think I can't do it, huh? Uh, I didn't mean anything by that. Come on, you've got to conjure up some cheese. Focus. Now, we now do you ha do you know how cheese is made? Surely, you heat some milk and add some lemon and salt and skim a solid part of it off the top, and it turns into cheese. Blimey, a regular cheese monger you are. This should be a cheesy peasy. This should be cheesy peasy then. All, all, all you need is the right spelling, innit? Sure, let me take a look. Oh gee, the only spell I haven't used. I think. Oh, am I? Okay, uh, where is it? It starts with an S and ends with an idiot! Look at that! It's flippin' working! It really is. You're good. You're so you're so good at magic, Oliver. I bet you could even make make sweets out of it if you put your mind and if you put your mind to it. And cakes! Oh, I just could eat it and Hey, stop that. I'm trying to concentrate. So implausible! Well, it's magic. Oh, of course, it's so implausible. Nice circular cheese sphere. Well, I guess not. <laughs> well, you did come up with some stuff there. What are they, milk candies? 
look at look at the flippin' size of it, man. And you j and you went and made some sweets and all. That was Esther's fault. <laughs> I bet you wanted some too, didn't you? Want some though, didn't you? Shouldn't distract somebody when they're trying to cast a spell. My backlash and turn me into a candy, bitch. How? Did oh, don't be, don't be like that. Now we can go to the Califia. Our presence a little on the large side, but I don't suppose it will matter. The bigger the better, I reckon. Let's please her with cheese. <laughs> Sitting on the ground in sand. She'll love it. Where'd all the sweets go? I want the fucking sweets. Oh, I'm gonna save. I haven't saved in a while, it seems. I haven't saved in a while, it seems. Jeez. Halt! You may not go before the colors without the permission of... Yeah, I guess I have to talk to him. Hello, it would be a service. We brought some cheese to Calivia, Mr. Abal, sir. Cheese? Praise be to the ancients. I had... I had thought there was none remaining in all the land. Why did he have to be so secretive about it? Couldn't we just ask him what her favorite food is? Like, at, at, on the spot? Like... <sighs> quest! Anyways. The Califia... The Califia just can't get enough of it, huh? Hmm? How did you hear this? It was a secret known by th those who within the palace. Why would... Oh, okay. I just kicked myself in the balls there. Whatever, fine. No matter, you are correct. Her Majesty indeed is a great admirer of cheese and many f of its forms, or whatever. She will undoubtedly grant an audience to any who come bearing such a gift. Please, you must follow me, quickly. Ho oh. ho! Hi, a real cutscene. A real Jahibli. That's the Kalipa? Cutscene. She probably ended up this way because of Shadar, the stinking rot bag. Oh. Mm, what is that divine aroma? Abu! Here, your majesty. Bountiful Kaulifa. His humble servants come bearing most delicious tribute. Oh, she's a big bitch. Bring it to us now, there's a good boy. Plus? Huh? You want me to take it to her? Quickly now, young man! Oh, jeez! This is gonna be awkward. Isn't this enabling or some shit? Ugh. Stop that. This is some horrible sounds I'm hearing. If I close my eyes, I'm hearing some weird shit. This is wrong! <laughs> what the fuck? I should have closed my eyes. <laughs> oh, sweet Jesus, that was fucking horrible. Cheesy wheeze. More? More? Bring us one more! Da 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 If you continue to eat so prodigiously, I fear you may burst. A bull! We are hungry! Your request does not go unheard, Majesty, but I fear for your bovinity's well-being. Bovinity? That there is one utterly broken heart. What? But... She might not look broken-hearted, but depending on which bit of heart is missing, all manner of weird things can happen. See, what her Majesty's lacking right now is a drop of restraint. Restraint? That's right. And without it, she can't control the urge to stuff her right royal face. We won't be getting any favors out of her until we've sorted this out. You mark my words. Okay. Hmm. So we need to find some restraint somewhere, huh? That's quick of you, Ollie boy. You have been paying attention after all. Let's go then, shall we? Please, you must do all you can to help her majesty. So... Okay, um... That'd be nice if that was if that could be done in reality for those really fat people that just can't move. Just give them some restraint. <laughs> restraint, restraint, huh? Can't think. Can't you think of anyone with uh with a lot of restraint, Esther? Hmm. Let's see. There must be someone. We can use the locket to try and find to try and look for someone. But this big old town, man. 
Let's try shopkeepers first, shall we? That's a neat idea, Mr. Trippy. The people who in the shops and everywhere in town might hear all the news, too. They do, don't they? Great! Let's ask around all the shops, then. In other words, let's slow down the gameplay. Hey, there's that guy. Yeah, oh, is that so? Well, well, well. So they've got they've got into the palace, did they? And what did they talk about? Did they now? Okay, keep me posted on what's going on inside. And my payment? Don't worry, you'll get your reward. But but next time we meet, uh, I'll have uh, I'll have scored you something decent. Do you mean that you will steal something? No, 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 don't be stupid. It's just a figure of speech. Now, concentrate on the job at hand, will you? I'm counting on you to keep, my, to keep to be my eyes and ears. Don't let me down. Mr. Green Jacket! Man, he needs new clothes. They're fucking tattered. It's part of his art design. Oh, I gotta run back. Well, at least it gives me a star. I see the option to turn it off. I would not want that turned off. It's like to know where to go. Sometimes in RPGs, I always get lost because you have to talk to this one guy. This one guy to continue the game. The waypoint cuts out the middleman. I mean, don't have to think. <laughs> I don't like thinking. Thinking hurts. 